Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Immuno Project. We here at the Immuno Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to information, education, inspiration, guidance, advice, and I want to continue in my series of video, uh, videos with respect to stories of the uh, uh, Hasidic masters. And um, there was um, there was a time when um, Rabbi Israel of Rizhin, this is the son of Rabbi Sholem Shachna, of Probisch. He got into an argument with Rav Moshe of Savran. It was they'd quarreled. There was a dispute. There was some machlekes, uh, some some disputation, and they left on not very good terms. Rav Moshe, Rav Moshe of Savran, he felt badly. He wanted to make peace, so he paid. Um, Rabbi Israel, a visit. Rabbi Israel asked him, do you believe there is a tzaddik, a righteous person, who clings to God unceasingly? <clears throat> Rabbi Moshe of Savran says, oh, yeah. there might well be someone who clings to God unceasingly, never lets go, he always hangs on, yeah, it's possible. Rabbi Israel of Rishon says, my uh, my grandfather was like that. My grandfather, Rabbi Avram, whom they called the angel, he was like that. Rabbi Moshe says, you know, now that I think of it, your grandfather, he didn't live very long. He didn't have many days on this earth, did he? Rabbi Avrishan, he says, and my father, Rabbi Sholem, Sholem Shachner. He was uh, like that too. He clung to, to Hashem unceasingly. Again, Rabbi Moshe says, come to think of it, your father didn't live very long. He didn't spend a lot of days on earth either. And Rabbi Israel Rizhin looks at Rabbi Moshe and he says, you always are speaking in terms of years and days and the length of a life. Do you think they were here on earth just to grow old and shrivel? They were here for a purpose. They came, they accomplished their purpose, they served God the way they were supposed to, they accomplished what they needed to accomplish, and then they returned to God. A lot of people don't know that there is a concept of reincarnation uh, in Judaism. And um, even when a person is not a Gilgal, not a reincarnation of someone else, um, there's a belief that a person comes here for a purpose. They are to accomplish certain things, bring about certain things. And once that has been accomplished, once they've done what they've been sent here to do, then they're called back to the Creator. And that why and that and some are called back very early. Young uh Chaimushka Zaltzman was called back at six years old. Some sages, some tzaddikim uh, live to be a ripe old age, eighty, ninety, a hundred, hundred and sansik, a hundred and twenty. They're set here for a purpose or a series of things. And once they've accomplished what God intended them to do, then they are called back. Don't concentrate on the years of a person's life. Look at their accomplishments. Someone can spend a long life accomplishing many things and is called at the end of a long life. And some little souls can accomplish so much in a mere six years. We're going to be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back. Please watch. Please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Immuno Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you too much.